Hey, what's up, guys? Kuniak here, and yes, I know, third video of the day. I might sound a lot more quieter, because I don't know why. Something just hit me. I didn't realize anything, <clears throat> but something hit me to where I just am having an off day. And mainly, I think I know what started it. I get irritated very easily by a lot of things, and so this video is going to be talking about my pet peeves. If you can sympathize, please leave down in the comments below. You'll make me feel a lot better. Just comment anyway. If you don't sympathize, just comment, comment, comment. Leave, share. It'll make my day a whole lot better. But oh, I've just been kind of in a rut lately, but that's another video for another day. Might post it later tonight. Still gonna be posting on Friday, don't worry. It's just sometimes I post a ton of videos in a couple of days and a single day. It, it happens. It happens to the best of us. But basically, pet peeve number one, I'm just gonna go into the numbers, is eating. I don't have a personal problem with eating, it's other people eating. And what I mean by that is that they, the type of people that make constant noises, constant noises, constant noises. My whole family sister drinks and you can hear every swallow. You can't hear nothing from me because it bothers me so I'm not going to do it to them because I don't want to bother them because I've had to get it from somewhere. My mom says, yeah, she has a same pet peeve, but she's the main conductor of this pet peeve. Always making noises, chewing with her mouth open. It's horrible, and I can't say anything about it, otherwise I'll get in trouble, which is probably the worst part. It's probably why I feel like this, is because I can't do nothing about it. And, and then, pet peeve number two has also something to do with dinner. My mom's the worst about this. Is that when you're having a conversation at dinner, cool, cool, socialize, it's dinner. You know, everybody's there, converse with each other. I'm cool with that. But every time you ask her a question, she has to throw down 600 chips before she'll be able to tell you, apparently. She, literally just tonight, my, she was telling us a story about something where she works. I'm not going to tell you because, I don't know, probably somehow it'll you'll find a way to use it against me. But it's like... Uh, she sat there. My dad asked her a question. She goes like, oh, pops down three chips and then tells us before she's even swallowed them yet. So we're still chewing some food in her mouth. God. I freaking hate it. And then another pet peeve of mine is when people sit there and drink like our tards. What I mean by that is people that sit there make gulping noises, slurping noises. Look at Matthew Santoro pet peeves video. He can basically tell you every single one of them in a very shorter, more compact version than I'm telling you. But I also hate the people that complain and complain and complain about everything. I complain about a lot of stuff. Like, I know I'm complaining right now. I complain about a lot of stuff, but I've nerfed it a lot. I've stopped complaining every five minutes. I used to complain all the time. And... It, it was just getting horrible, in my opinion. I was always complaining. And, you know, I stopped it. And then I also... Then you get people... I'm not going to say his name. But you guys have seen him before in videos. I'm not going to tell you what it is. But ever since he got the Xbox One. That's all you've been hearing about. Stuff about he hates about it. Stuff he doesn't like about it. Stuff that irritates him about it. He never shuts up about it because I don't know, but it makes me mad. And it's like you can't even talk to the guy without him bringing up a point of how he's irritated with his Xbox. And I just don't know what to do. It's annoying. I'm not going to say anything because he is a great friend. <sighs> Another thing I hate, this is kind of a typical teen thing, is when... You're talking to the girl you like, and she doesn't even really respond. The girl I like, I talk to her, we have, she's a good friend too. But, you know, I've seen other people just struggle with it. It's more of a sympathy thing that I feel here. 
And yeah. Another thing that I hate is people that have to make fun of you because they just feel like that it makes them cool. I don't know. I don't know why they have to. It's horrible. They're horrible people. And yeah. So basically, thank you for listening to me complain and letting all this out. If you want more videos like this to help you sympathize and let my let me bring out my personal side with you guys, definitely let me know. I like doing these. It lets a lot of steam off my chest. I can bring back the weekly rage rant. I only posted one video because I don't, I didn't have too many things to rage about. And so, also, a thing that calms me down, if you guys also get irritated, but I think that is something that calms me down is get jumping on Xbox and watching YouTube at the same time. Like a matter of fact, behind my Elgato program is a YouTube video right now. I hope you all enjoyed this, or if you feel offended by this, I'm sorry. Uh, definitely let me know, leave a like, comment, share, dislike, I don't care. Give me feedback. Tell me what I can do better. If you left a dislike, tell me what I can do better. If you left a like, tell me why you left a like. And I just want to get you guys immersed in my channel because my channel is your channel. I need, you guys are the ones that are going to form it. I'm the one that's just going to actually do it. You tell me something to do, I do it. You guys don't tell me something not to do, I'll not do it. You guys are the ones that form this channel and I'll see you all later.